He was doing what most MPs do on a Friday. Inside this Methodist church in Essex, Sir David Amos was taking part in a constituency surgery. At around midday, he was attacked here. Emergency services attempted to treat him for several hours, but at just after three, his death was confirmed. The victim of a stabbing, and once again, a public servant killed whilst doing their job. It is an incredible shock. I mean, you don't expect it in a church. You don't expect it anywhere, to be perfectly frank and honest. I know there's been a lot of knife crime recently, but uh, again, there's no justification for that either. So, um, it, but in a sanctuary of a church, where, a church where it's supposed to be a safe place, then um, I'm really deeply shocked that somebody could do this. Police say they made an arrest shortly after arriving at the scene. That 25-year-old man is now in custody after being arrested on suspicion of murder. A knife was also recovered. I would ask my right honourable friend if he would find time for a debate. Sir David had been the MP for Southend West since the 90s after first entering Parliament in 1983. This afternoon, in the minutes after his death was confirmed, one of his closest friends in the community told me of his shock. He believed you help people and that's what he did and whether you were a Muslim or whatever he had respect for all those sorts of religions he would go and meet them he would join in with them with all the different cultures very well respected by them there'll be a lot of people very upset by what's happened while the exact circumstances of Sir David's death are being ascertained the shockwaves from this attack will be felt across the entire country